We're down here in a broadcast lane today, and uh, we got uh, the former uh, caretaker here at the, the Winchester Hotel. And uh, he was just admiring some of the artists that work back here. What's going on with this graffiti art back here? I think it's really awesome. A lot of people like it. And I noticed in the last summer alone, there must have been about 15 people from the States coming through here looking at it, taking pictures. And they were emailing us pictures back and all, and all this stuff. And so it's a great thing what they're doing. And I was a troublemaker when I was a kid, and I'm glad I'm not no more. So I've got, you know. But yeah, I think it's a great thing, and a lot of people like it. A lot of, they get a couple that don't, but. But other than that, it's like it's an okay thing. Yeah, it nice. should be done more often. Thanks for talking with us. These are two of the artists who have done a lot of it, Bubbles and Fade. And uh, our property owner here uh, has been kind enough to allow us to do it. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Uh, this is a good idea. You know, uh, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a beautiful painting. The, uh, the young people are a real artist. I really like it because before it was so ugly, the message is wrong, you know, it's not a friendly environment after the painting, you know, it's great. You thank know, you. I like it. Thank you for yes, giving us permission. The, thank you for, the, for organizing this, and you know, our police force is great. <laughs> Do you all the best job. <laughs> thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it. This is 517 Parliament Street, Toronto, Ontario, Canada. And the gentleman there's uh, got a little computer business in here. And, uh, TBC Tribal Bridges crew uh, painted down here. And uh, the gentleman got a new door. This was done a while ago. So Bubbles is coming down to fix it up. Hey, you know what's behind this door? Oh, I just found out because I was trying to talk to the person who owns the door. These people called You for Change. And it's like a. It's a youth center type of place and they're having an event on May 15, 2010. I'm gonna go check it out and uh, we work something out where I can do an art workshop and then they're gonna get a mural so the kids that you know work in here we're gonna work together and do a mural on the inside. So Nothing better than the change. community coming together. There you go. You know, sometimes it happens by accident sometimes you gotta push for it to happen but it'll happen. You got a website on there uh, Kedri? Is there a website on that thing? If anybody's looking for more information? Um, I, no, I don't see anything right now. We'll take oh, one yeah, of those. Yeah, yeah. You know what? www.uforchange.ca. This looks like it's uh, funded by Citizenship and Immigration of uh, Canada. There you go. So, uforchange.ca. Representing that Jamestown. Let's keep it real. <laughs> 